Today on the Boot Guy, we're talking about the four inch Romeo slip on with a safety toe from Carhartt. Now you might call this shoe a molder shoe and you might call this shoe a Romeo. I kind of look at this shoe as just being an incomplete pull-on boot. Guys really do like it. Guys find this type of boot to be really comfortable and really practical in the work environment. Now Carhartt uses what they call a blown rubber sole. And basically, this is probably the worst type of material in most job applications. Blown rubber is not a very good material to use for a sole. And you'll find a lot of companies that do use this in their boots. And you'll find a lot of people who are unhappy with these type of soles. They don't last very long. They don't have very good traction at all if water is present, though they are extremely comfortable. When you pull a boot out of the box that's made with a blown rubber sole like this Carhartt boot is, it's going to feel amazing. These soles really do add a lot of energy return to your step. Unfortunately, they don't play nice around abrasive type surfaces. Freshly poured concrete, poured garage floors, places where your auto mechanics and motorcycle mechanics will work. This shoe, though it is the perfect looking shoe for those environments, and you would think by the way it feels that it would be tremendous, it is not. Now the four inch Romeo, it is waterproof with a waterproof membrane. And that makes it a really nice casual boot. Or in that case, this boot would be great for a guy who needs a pair of steel toes that needs to wear them maybe five or six times out of the year to go to a job site or to go inside a plant. This boot would be ideal because it's easy on, it's easy off, it's extremely comfortable and it's waterproof. Now Carhartt did a really nice job of picking out this leather. It's a nice, heavy, sturdy leather. The leather is gonna hold up to almost anything. And for the weight of it, for it being a steel toe shoe, it is exceptionally lightweight to the hand. The rear heel cup is real nice and tight as you should find in a pull-on shoe because you're gonna need it to fit really nicely back here. You can see how it rounds up, how it rounds in back there. That's, a, that's actually a really nice detail on this boot. It's the shape of the heel up into the Achilles tendon. That's pretty nice. Now the instep is kind of tight too. So it's gonna stay on your foot. You're gonna get a better fit. Though I have heard from guys many, many times that after a few months, these things become really loose. That's in situations where guys are looking to wear this every single day. And this is really not an everyday work boot. This is a special occasions work boot. And I know that sounds funny, a special occasions work boot, but that's truly what it is. This isn't your shovel kicking, engine pulling type boot. This is really something that's made for somebody who wants a casual steel toe boot, wants it to be comfortable out of the box, and can depend on it to be comfortable for the life of the boot. Now Carhartt does a really nice job of lining the inside of this boot, the full vamp all the way through. It's a nice soft material. You'll find it in most of their boots. It's a brown duck type polyester. Really comfortable, really nice and soft to the hand and to the stock and foot. Now for an insole, they send along this single density urethane insole with this dry type material on the top. It's actually a really nice insole. The density is really nice. I don't see this thing breaking down prematurely, or off I do see the sole wearing down prematurely. This insole, that sole, the comfort, it's all there. It's gonna be a comfortable boot. Now in closing, I realize I have not said many good things about this boot, except that it's really not a work boot. If you need a boot that you're gonna be comfortable in, and you don't need it to go kick a shovel, climb in and out of a truck, you know, get down in the hole and tie some rods. This shoe is really nice if you just need a safety shoe that's easy on and off. Now the guys that are looking at this thinking, well, that's gonna be my motorcycle riding boot for the weekend. Also, guys, the sole, okay? This blown sole, 
is not gonna perform well on wet concrete when you gotta stop at a stoplight. Maybe also think about looking somewhere else. Now, if you're only gonna wear it on dry days or dry nights, and you're just gonna cruise around in the city, and you just want something that looks really sharp, well, this boot does look really sharp. So that's the Carhartt four inch Romeo, safety toe, waterproof. Hey, if you've ever worn the four inch Romeo, if you own a pair, please comment below. Let guys know what you thought about the sole, about the waterproof membrane, and about the fit of this boot. Hey, if you're interested in knowing more about this boot, swing by the bootguy.com. There I'll have a nice little detailed description about the boot, and I will also have a link if you wanna pick a pair up, or if you just want to see some detailed photos of the welting of the boot, of the elastic sides, the leather pull-on, and the sole, hey, swing by the bootguy.com. Please don't forget to hit my subscribe button below. It really helps out. And if you should have any questions about your next boot purchase, hey, shoot me over an email. Ask away. All right, until the next time, I'm the Boot Guy. Thanks a lot for watching. The rear heel cup is real nice and tight as you should find in a pull-on shoe.